Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It is Sarah and in today's video, I'm going to be teaching you guys how to use spell check in Figma. So let's like get right into it. So I'm going to go ahead and minimize my screen. And basically how this works is you're going to go to this little Figma logo up here. And you're going to click on this little down arrow and then you should go all the way to like near the bottom where it says tax. Not like the bottom, like more like in the middle, like upper, like middle up. I don't know what you want to call it, but... You're going to, like, hold on, and you see this, like, little pop-up next to it, and you're going to scroll all the way down to this little spell check, and then you go into, like, the, like, language that you're going to do. So, we're going to be doing the auto-detect language because, like, we're using, like, English, and then it tells you if it's, like, basically how this works is if you're doing something, like, random, it'll try to, like, it kind of helps you. So... It just like checks the spelling for you to make sure you're spelling it like all correct and stuff and if something it's like they don't find it in the dictionary it's not like a word to be found then if it's most of like most of the time it could be like a name or something but then you just don't worry about it because if it's a name then you know how to spell it unless you're like actually like spelling the name completely wrong because sometimes you like unique names like they won't be in like the dictionary but, like words like really simple like like the really simple names like emily emma stuff like that um gia avery all that stuff so those are really like common so it's like easy to like, get those like correct and stuff so this one like helps you with spelling check and stuff because if you spell it um hey wrong like h-e-y like hi hey um then it's like well most of the time you wouldn't get that wrong but it's like gonna just help you and spell check is something that I personally think is so cool because sometimes like I may mistype or maybe I don't even just in general know how to spell a word and it's like really helpful so yeah anyways thanks for watching today's video make sure to subscribe to my channel and have an amazing day goodbye guys